We presented the map on the BenQ interactive display during our MPA class for the Digital Technologies and Public Policy route, and we invited the students to play around with the map through different exercises. The map helped the students to better understand the governance structure of UK cybersecurity by looking at who the main policy actors are, what they're working on, and how they work with one another across the government. And what you notice when you use the map is that there's so many different types of players within another player. Uh, so it's really a great way to sort of visualize um, what kind of stakeholders are involved and if they're working with policy questions or law enforcement or any other types of issues. In addition to being a really unique, hands-on and fun experience for them, research has shown that an active and learner-centric teaching method can increase student engagement. So this is where the BenQ interactive display becomes really useful because you can navigate the map by zooming in and zooming out of different levels of the map structure. I mean, when you're using a sort of large screen and a big map where you can actually use your hands and fingers, it creates a little bit more engagement, especially if you're working together in a group. I would just imagine the setting with a group, and if we all had our specific computer, it wouldn't have been as collaborative. Um, so that's very, very key when doing sort of group project. I, think. Um, I would definitely recommend it specifically for group assignments, as it sort of creates this uh, dynamic and collaborative environment naturally. People want to sort of click on the screen and have a little go at um, identifying different areas. So I think it's perfect for group settings.